Hi, I'm here. Ready to paint. What's up, everybody? I really wanted to figure out how to play music, but it's also one of those things. If I upload this on YouTube. So let's, oh. Like, if I just play a radio, or if I go to YouTube, what happens? And I, YouTube. Is it weird to, like, watch YouTube while recording a YouTube video? Everything's in Spanish because I'm in Mexico. FYI, which is a little hard because I um, don't speak Spanish well. So here, let's just, let's see what happens when we click this. WordTune is your rewriting, rephrasing, what? rewording, <laughs> sexpialidocious Chrome extension. We get to watch um. YouTube videos. So is the sound like everywhere? What happens if I go way over here? Oh my gosh. So you know. Let's just roll with it. Lo-fi hip hop tunes. Oof. A little loud in my head. I don't know if they're loud for you. Just volume. Yeah, I can. Well, there we go. So we can listen to YouTube while recording a YouTube video. And if that ain't some shit, then I don't know what is. So I'm gonna move these here because they keep like flying around. Um, and I mean. Can YouTube take my video down if I'm streaming a YouTube video to put on YouTube? That's a pretty meta question to ask. But here we are painting, and this isn't a timed one. I am doing a big old boy. Um, I'm just getting the colors down. Awesome that we can just throw color. Like, the further I step back, I'm playing. Like, I love those side glitch marks when you, like. They're just so good. Oh, look at that. Oh my gosh. I don't know what this is yet. Ooh, too white. I want it. I like the neon that's going on. So let's. I'm just going with it. We're listening to some lo fi hip hop beats. And I guess this is a test too like, is uh, YouTube gonna take. Oop, too much. YouTube gonna take. That's really cool though. I just want that bright pink back though. Like in here, I think 
there was some orange with it. That really made it zing. Let's get that. And let's get some purple. atmospheric now, wouldn't you say? I really like how you can see the shine. All of it is vibing with me right now. So what do we want in here? I think we want to start in here. Making marks, seeing where it takes me. I'm just making marks. Just some marks. I just got done playing Beat Saber too, so I'm a little tired. And I filed my taxes, which wasn't as bad as I thought, but still, brain drain. Oh, I like where this is going, actually. It feels like a chaos person coming out. Like, I see I here. Scoop back a little. Ah, get more cozy. I'm like sitting on the edge of my seat. What's gonna happen next? This is pain and relax time. I haven't had time to like just paint or the energy. I don't know, the full moon kind of messed me up a little, you know? It's 
some glue though in here. Let's glue it. So a trick with eyes is, if you want them to be realistic, which a lot of you should probably know if you do art at all, but you never want them to be pure white. So, and you always, that, I messed that up at one point, okay, there we go. Um, you never really want them to be pure white, because even though, unless you're going for like a cartoon style, but even then, like, I still think it like feels better if they're not pure white like even a little bit of off-white and um, a little bit of shading because uh, eyes are just not that white like in our mind we categorize things and when we're like especially when we're first making art we tend to like go off of what our mental like iconic icon iconic iconograph Ic iconography iconography we tend to go off that and not like think about a we say white to eyes but it's not literal white to eyes Freaking frack. Okay. And okay. what's Halloween lo fi vibes? Let's go with spooky. It's just I've listened to that other channel a lot. It's always on the front page of YouTube when you're not signed in. Let's get spooky. My. Glitching a little. Do you guys see that? There we go. The yellow suddenly like made me think of like fake nice people for some reason. Like you know the people where this without like specifically calling someone out but okay like say you go somewhere and you're like I'm here I'm at this place and then like for whatever reason like you're you're at going to like different parties and stuff. I'm trying to think about how to tell this story without like being a jerk about it. But say you're like going to different parties and stuff. You're going to like a festival. Let's say that. You're going
Pomona Festival. And there's a whole bunch of parties. There's some that are exclusive. There's some that aren't. And let's say, like, people know for a fact you're there. And they, like, are, like... And then you're, like, oh, I couldn't get into this one thing, like, after the fact. And they're, like, oh, well, if I would have known you were there, um, I would have X, Y, Z. Um, or... Like, I think, like, the same applies, like, oh my, like, I was having this trouble, and, I, like, you, like, are talking about it very publicly, and then people are like, oh, if I would have known, I would have helped you, and it's like, I think you did know, and I think, like, <laughs> I think that, like, it's, like, this, like, fake, like, thing after the fact I don't know if it's making any sense what I'm saying but like this like fake act of kindness where it's like they're not doing anything really but they're trying to like act like they're a good person when they're actually just trying to like feel like a good person they're not actually doing anything to warrant them being a good person does that make any sense what I'm saying? I think it does. But I'm just like, I the yellow, like, it just made me think of that. Like, people that have been like that. Um, because some people are just, like, I mean, I'm not 100% perfect, and I don't want to rail completely on people, but some people really... be fake and if you're someone if you're watching this and you're someone who's done that to me specifically and you're like oh my god is this about me it may be I mean I'm not gonna be like sugarcoating it um if you've like after the if you've known goddamn well like I needed help with something or like you didn't like and after the fact, you were like, oh, you know, sorry if I would have known. Yeah, you, damn well it's about you. But I mean, like, there's genuinely people who don't know. But it's, I'm specifically talking about people where it's like, I think they knew. And it's like, oh, they do it repeatedly. And it's like, they swoop in and be like, oh, if I would have known, I would have fixed all your problems. And it's like, really though? Would ya? Is that really what's going on here? Do you just want to feel like you're a good person? Um, cause you ain't. You just fake in a lot of ways. Anyway, I'm being a bitch. I'm being a, a, a lady dog. And this face is getting all that annoyance, I think. I want some green over here just to make the purple and right here just get the green. I need to download better palettes where I can like choose more colors because even though this is a wide spectrum I still feel like it's like oh like it's not getting like the minutia of colors does that make sense like some of the like gradients and granted I'm mixing on here but I feel like I should like I really need to download a better palette let's get some green what's this guy doing I don't know he's being annoyed at fake people and there's not anyone that's done it recently I should like super clarify that memories coming up you know you know how they do that they just kind of random things from past past ages just float to the surface while you're painting a lot I don't want to call out this specific memory because I don't want to call anyone out. I don't want to like. I'm. I don't want drama. I don't want to start shit. But I'll finish it. 
21 when pregnant. Who is this guy? I believe it's a guy. Why is he so sad? We need to get more black in there. Ooh, the blue. You don't always have to go with pure black. I mean, I'm gonna keep layering and adding more. Ooh. That after, just not now. Best part of digital painting. Oops, I messed up. Undo. Ah, it feels. I'm gonna sit back. Oh, sorry, I sat back on my. You can see my. There's glitch. <laughs> my house. I'm wondering if I pick that up. This little guy. This little guy. Oop. I'm not even recording. Oh yeah, I am. Okay. How do we fill the rest of this out? Ugh, I wanna like lay back. And I keep popping out. I'm sorry. You get a sneak peek at my house though. Okay, I put pillows behind me so I can lean back. Like in my art studio, when I used to have an art studio, I would like sit on the sofa for hours. <sighs> Just staring at a painting living with it especially when it takes longer like you just need to sit with it i think with technology like we tend to feel rushed there's some parts of the traditional painting process that really we shouldn't lose So now I'm gonna. Ooh, where did my paintbrush go?
thinking about right now. See how I made it pop just a little, just a little. Some of the questions still remain. What do we do with the rest? Making brush strokes, I think. And let's get this mixed in again. I just was like thinking about like a lot of this stuff going on that I can't necessarily talk about always. Um, just business side of stuff. And how sometimes I get bogged in the details and I forget about the bigger picture. I think we all like suffer from that. And just stepping back. So I feel like they're doing something I don't want them to do. I just want to push paint around and I'm just going to add more to what's happening. like isolating this guy too much from all the other energy going on and making it like almost two separate paintings and I feel like just blending these out will like help bring it together. Yeah, it feels better. It feels better. We're gonna blend a little bit more in here though. Now that I have it smaller, I can blend more of this out. Now it feels like they live together. But this guy is kind of emerging and energy's coming from him, not like this weird isolation. He's integrating into everything yeah that's I want the white. I want the 
shots are fun, but there's something you bring in towards the end. You can't have anything that hard going on. We do need more green. So. Let's. that over there so they fit together. So I'm gonna clean this up. stuffy in here in my house and the AC was kicked in again and it feels so much better. So much better. What is this symbol? I have no idea. It's something though, ain't it?
I spent all that time structuring it and then I'm like, no man. Vortex for me here. Ah, uh, yeah, we do. This is so great. Marks are gonna look sick when I blow it up, and you and I both know this. Whoever's watching this, it's gonna look sick. I think I got too much yellow going on though. Let's uh, oops. bring the pink back. Ghost to my ceilings. Okay. He's 
so close to the edge. That was maybe a bad move. Ugh. What can we do? Well, we can't. Oops, you can see my house because I'm leaning back so much. We can't, like, cut them out. I think we just live with it. After the fact, I could bring this into Procreate. There we go. And like cut around, slide it over just a smidge, but I don't know, maybe we can make it work. Right now, I'm feeling pretty tired though. And I'm pretty happy with where we got. So I think I'm gonna leave this as part one of whatever this is about aliens. I think we'll figure out in part two what this is about aliens. What do you think? The fake kindness of aliens that we were going? Oh, I just love all these moments. Look at all those moments. And you saw how fast that was. Ugh, I love it. Just chaos. Chaos. Alright. What do we do? We save. Whatever. We save and we exit through here. We remember to save. There's my stealing again. So yeah, here we are. I'm pretty happy with it. I'm pretty happy with where we got. I really like how I discovered how to make those marks. Like I feel like I'm gonna do that more. Scale down and scale up and work in and work out. When we come back, we'll be probably playing more in here. Like, we're gonna leave a lot of this stuff. But I know definitely, like, I wanna get it a little bit more painterly, like, the strokes that are in there, just so it fits together. Cause right now, it feels still like this separation because the paint strokes in there aren't really fitting in with what's going on over here and vice versa. And I don't want to mess him up. I like where we got him. We may need to clean up that little bit of white splatter on his lips. Oh no. That's crazy town. I <laughs> just kidding. Um, but I want to like bring the feel of it together more. And it can be brought together with color. But then also we just need to get some of the same type of painter style over here. Um, and I think it's just going to be, yeah, I'm going to work in with some paint strokes and feel out maybe another form over here of something. Like I do kind of see a monster, but I want to like, I want to hang out away from it before I like attack this chaos. I want this chaos to sit. So yeah, that is all for this part of this painting. I appreciate you coming along on this journey we're lis we're watching listening to youtube together while i make a youtube video please like and subscribe per usual check out my work you know if you want to buy some buy some if you can't afford it or you don't like it don't have to um share with friends who are into vr painting or painting or any dope shit stuff sorry I peace be kind. Yeah.